Hello, YouTube. Well, I had another thrift store score today. And that would be these RCA, supposed RCA speakers. These are actually Radio Shack speakers from the early 2000s. V Westlife has a pair of these as well. Uh, I got these for $12 as a set. And that was well worth it, I think. They're 8 ohm speakers, uh, 40 watts RMS. And the date code is August of 2002. The other one is July of 2002, so they're actually year correct, but they're not a matched set. Uh, that doesn't really matter. I'll take the cover off one of them so you can see it. <clears throat> What's nice about these is, compared to the old Minimuses, these have a cloth surround, so you don't have to worry about r rotting foam or anything. I have a nice tweeter up there that, you know, does good things. <laughs> So I'll stick the grills back on this one, and we'll give these a listen. I have never listened to these before. I wonder if they sound any better than the old Minimuses did. <clears throat> so, oh God. Wow, these actually sound really good. I'm quite surprised. I think it's best to use a CD though, so let's stick a CD in there. The CD I have today is one that I highly recommend to anybody, to everybody. You actually do have to buy this on Amazon. <clears throat> it's not anywhere else on the internet I could find. You act. This is one you kind of have to buy the CD for because I think the CD is out of print now. But it's listen to the music, '70s singer slash songwriters. It has really good stuff on it. You want to pause and read those? There you go. All right. So let's stick that CD in here. The CD is from about '96. I think the speakers are older than that, but that's okay. All right. Let's test it with some Todd Rundgren. Let's track eight. Wow. Hello, it's me. I thought about us for a long, long time. I'm impressed. These things sound amazing for their size. They have really deep bass, they have really strong treble. Let me listen to these some more. Maybe I think too much, but something's wrong. Yeah, they actually have mid range, unlike the Minimus 7s do. These are a lot better, in my opinion. Uh, what else can we test here? Uh, this will test bass. Like a bird on the wire, like a drunk in a midnight choir, I have tried in my way to be free. Yeah, these speakers are awesome, man. I'm impressed. If any of you guys see a pair of these, don't pass them up. They sound very good, and they sound ten times better than the Minimus 7s ever will. The Minimus 7s have a hole in the mid-range effect when you listen to them, whereas these do not. For those of you who actually want to find a pair of these, they are catalog number 40-5022. You can probably look those up in the Radio Shack catalogs. They might be in there. So, that's these speakers. One hell of a one hell of a set of speakers, I'd say. They were nice and cheap too. I bet the Goodwill thought they were just cheap no name speakers because of the RCA logo, but uh they might have been deceived. These are actually really nice. Other than that, have a good one everybody. Ciao.